Alright, first and foremost, I want to give all praises to the Most High, Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and salutations to the brothers of pushing his will, in truth, and sincerity. I just want to touch on something here, you know, considering the two thirds, you know, um, you know, basically the Most High really have a zeal, you know, to destroy the two thirds. Right, because I mean, they just going against all the Mosai commandments, laws, and statutes. You know, they, they just want to follow Esau. They want to follow follow the other heathen nations. You know, they want to do everything except for the for the laws, statutes, and commandments of the Most High. Right, I'll start with Second Ezra fifteen and twenty four. It says, "Woe to them that sin." Keep not my commandments, saith Yahweh. I will not spare them. Right? So the Mosai will not spare the sinners. Right? And it's basically, you know, the two thirds is the one that really um that really sinning. Because I mean and this is actually talking about Israel here because it can't be the other hidden nations because the the laws wasn't given to them. So therefore we know this is Israel we're speaking about here. Right? It says verse twenty five, I will not spare them. It says, Go your way, ye children, from the power, defile not my sanctuary. Verse twenty six. He said, For Yahweh know it all that all that sin against him. So the most knows all things. He knows every he knows every single person. Right, and he knows everyone that sins against him. Right, it goes on to say, and therefore delivereth he them unto death and destruction. The Holy Scripture says, "What the wages of the wages of sin is death." Right, so therefore, once you wanna keep going against the Mosai laws, statutes, and commandments, what's gonna happen? He says he will he will deliver them he will deliver he them unto death and destruction. In a sense, so basically the Moses is going to deliver you up, right? It says, for now are the plagues come upon the whole earth, and ye shall remain in them. So the two thirds of Israel is going to remain in these plagues. You understand? They're going to get sick. They're going to get diseases. They're basically reserved for the ICBM. Right? It says, For your for, for your hour shall not deliver you. Because ye have sinned against him. And and you know, just just, just pretend, you know, that World War Three is on the brink. You know, the the RFID chip is mainstream. You understand? And the Mosai is telling you. That he's not going to deliver you up out of that, and you wicked niggas just want to continue going against Mosai. There's only one thing that's going to come to you, and that is that you niggas are to be really wicked to want to go up against the Mosai and uh, uh, and want to, you know, want to follow um different idols, different gods. You understand? So basically, two thirds of Israel is going to be cut off, right? According to Zechariah, right? I'm gonna to go to um, uh, Ezekiel. I'll go to Ezekiel five and um, and twelve. All right. Yeah, I'll start at twelve. Ezekiel 5 and 12 it says a third part of thee shall die with the pestilence and with famine shall they be consumed in the midst of thee and a third part shall fall by the sword round about thee and I will scatter the third part into all the winds and I will draw out a sword after them Right, so what's going to happen there? The most is going to, you know, you know, you know, send pestilences upon the earth, send famine, 
right? And he's gonna draw a sword, right? He said that he said that verse thirteen, thus shall my anger be accomplished, and I will cause my fury to rest upon them, and I will be comforted, right? And they shall know that I Yahweh have spoken. It is my zeal. The most I seen is it's his zeal basically to cut off the two thirds. You understand? That's I mean just just picked it up. You know, you know you know basically if you have a zeal for something, right? You have a liking for it, right? So you're gonna you're gonna you know put all your might, put everything behind. You know whatever you're going going after like for instance if, you, if your zeal is basketball right you're gonna put you, you're gonna train hard you're gonna put everything behind that if your zeal is football you're gonna put everything behind it right so the most i've seen is that it is his zeal right to basically cut off the two thirds you see when i have accomplished my fury in them you understand? So basically, I mean, the two dudes are, are not going to survive. You understand? The Mosa is not going to deliver you out of his fury, out of his destruction. You understand? So, you know, that, that just, uh, just, just a short thing on, on um, the two dudes, basically. Right? Again, I'm going to say all praises to Yahweh, Bahasham Yahushai. Double honors again to the apostles and others of Great Millstone, and salutation to all the Akim that pushing this word in truth and sincerity. Shalom.